This is an interesting question stem for this CR question which says which of the following statement best captures statements best captures the problem mentioned in the paragraph given above. Now what does the paragraph say? It talks of uh, having self-confidence, a need for self-confidence and a good self-image and it says that when this confidence turns to conceit people invite the proverbial downfall. Uh, we've, you've heard the proverb pride comes before a fall right? Uh, some ideologists train their pupils to develop an unjustified adulation of their own personal judgment. This is what uh, is our main line here, uh, is the crux, uh, let's say, that there are certain teachers who train their pupils to develop an unjustified adulation, adulation is uh, praise or self-praise, let's say, of their own personal judgment. So these people, they praise their own judgment as they are taught by certain ideologists causing whole societies to collapse from ideologies that nurture internal thought conceit, right? Now, uh, if we have to look for a statement that best captures the entire, the problem mentioned, what is the problem? Uh, this, isn't it this, that there are some teachers who uh, teach their students or teach their pupils to uh, look upon themselves to have, a, uh, let's say, overconfidence and to uh, trust their own personal judgment instead of trusting others too. Now let's try and find that from among the options. A says we can be impartial in one area of our lives and plagued by prejudice in another. As soon as you read it, I'm sure you will eliminate this option. It has nothing to do with the problem in the question. It takes wrenching experiences to tear us away from our own thought conceit. Does it talk of wrenching experiences, the uh, problem, the text? No, it does not. People have difficulty recognizing thought conceit in themselves. It does say that people have a lot of thought conceit sometimes, but uh, it does not talk of people having difficulties or not having difficulties in recognizing or not recognizing thought conceit, right? Cannot take it to be the answer. Answer is D. Option D says not all educators, ideologists in the question teach their pupils, right? As in the question, as the question says, respect for self-discipline and humility, right? So since there is no humility being taught, since there is, since there is no self-discipline being taught, since all the teachers trust your own personal judgments and that is why whole societies collapse, that is what the conclusion is. And so this is our, the main problem. It best expresses or captures the problem mentioned in the paragraph. The answer for the CR question is option D.